Sterling Heights police sergeant is being hailed as a hero. Video released today shows the officer saving the life of a choking toddler. Jacqueline Francis live tonight with a look at the footage and what the department has to say about it. Jacqueline. Devin, that one-year-old girl is alive and well, likely thanks to the quick and calm thinking of a Sterling Heights police sergeant. Take a look. Sergeant Anthony Rusky got to the home in less than a minute. The frantic parents called 911 last Thursday. Please come to my house right now. Their one-year-old baby girl was choking. My daughter, I don't know what happened to her. Please hurry. Is she breathing? breathing? I know. Getting out of his vehicle, rushing up to the home. Not sure exactly what's going on. You have a very frantic and panicking family. Without hesitation, the sergeant goes into action. Does back thrusts on the baby. Ends up doing a like a finger sweep of the of the mouth to get the uh, you know the object out of there. Oh my God! And ultimately, the baby starts breathing again. You know, coughing and coughs up the object, and ends up starts crying, which is good because that's a sign that it's breathing. Um, and just an absolute, just an amazing job by Sergeant Rusky. Sterling Heights Public Information Officer Lieutenant Mario Bastinelli says this is what they train for. Rusky being hailed a hero. The sergeant is a 20-year veteran on the force and a father himself. Having that personal aspect of having children definitely makes it a lot more of a stressful situation for our officers because we know the fact that we have kids and that could happen at any time as well. Luckily and thankfully for this family, Sergeant Rusky arrived on scene very quickly, took action, and ended up saving the baby. Police also want to use this as a good reminder that when in an emergency, call 911 right away as every second matters when it's a case like this one, and try to be as calm as possible when communicating to dispatch so that they can get you the help you need. Reporting live, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. What a moment. All right, Jacqueline.